Hi children, how are you? I hope you all are fine, safe, healthy at your home with your parents. Now I am Anita Saraswat and today we will discuss about the Roman numerals maths topic for the 4th standard. So let's start. Children you know which numbers we used to write. These numbers are called the Hindu Arabic numerals and we form these numbers by using these digits 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. By using only these digits we make the numbers. But in Roman numerals we don't use these digits. We use the letters. Which letters? There are certain letters. They are I, B, X, L, C, D and M. Only we use these letters to form the Roman numerals. They, these letters are having some specific value. What are these? Just see I stands for 1, V stands for 5, X stands for 10, L stands for 50, C stands for 100, D stands for 500 and M stands for 1000. Then you will think ki what about 0? So children, there is no letter in Roman numerals for 0. Now, just check how we will write, how we will use these letters to write the Roman numerals. Just come on this chart. They, these are the Hindu Arabic numerals and we have to write these Hindu Arabic numerals in the Roman numerals. So, for writing the Roman numerals, we have to follow certain rules. Just check it. First rule is we can repeat I, X, C and M only 3 times, not more than 3 times. Just come on the table here to see that is I, X, C and M. We can repeat only these letters to form the numbers. Okay, just see if we have to write 1, how we write 1? Uh, we know that I stand for 1. So we have to write 1. So we will write 1 I. Now 2 2. We have to write I 2 times. Because 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. So I plus I. If we have to add we have to write. We can repeat this I 2 times and 3 times. Now 3 we will write 1 plus 1 plus 3. 1. This is I, I and I. This is 3. Now we have to write 4. So what we will do? Because we cannot repeat I more than 3 times. So just check the second rule. Second rule is smaller letters can be added or subtracted from the bigger letters. But all the letters, we, all the smaller letters we cannot subtract from the bigger letter. Okay, are added from the bigger letter. So, what letter we can add and subtract from what? Just see. That is I. I we can subtract from or add to V and X. Now, X we can subtract from or add to L and C. Now, C we can subtract from or add to D and M. Now, just come on this table. That is I. I we can subtract or add to B and X. Just see. I can be subtracted or added to B and X. Now see. X can be added or subtracted to L and C. Now C can be added or subtracted to D and M. Just see. By this table you can better understand to what Later, the smaller letter you can add or subtract which bigger letter. Okay. Now just come on 4. We have to write 4. And we know we cannot repeat I more than 3 times. So we are having option ki we can subtract 1 from 5. So V stand from 5. So we can subtract 1 from 5. But how can we add or subtract? That's see. see 
if we have to add any digit any letter from the bigger letter we have to write it in the left side and if you have to subtract any smaller letter to bigger letter we have to write it left side now to write 4 we have to subtract 1 from 5 so how we will write it 5 is the bigger letter so v stand for 5 so first we will write v here and minus 1 minus 1 means i we will write in the left side of the v so that will be 4 now 5 we know that v stand for 5 so we will write here v only now 6 6 means we can write 5 plus 1 5 plus 1 6 so 5 is v and if we have to add any letter we have to write it in right side so i we will write here in the right side of the v so that is 5 plus 1 6 now 7 5 plus 2 5 plus 2 that is 7 8 5 plus 3 that is 5 plus 3 that is 8 now 9 we can x so see here we can subtract 1 from 10 if we will subtract 1 from 10 we will get 9 so that is 10 minus 1 so 10 minus 1 10 stands for x minus 1 so we will write i in the left side of the 10 so this is 9 and 10 we know that x stands for 10 okay so we can write the number 1 to 10 like that now if you have to write 11 to 20 the same thing you have to follow how we will write 11 10 plus 1 to write 11 we have to write 10 plus 1 so 10 we know x stands for 10 and 1 1 is i if we have to add we will write it in right side now 12 10 plus 2 so x plus 2 now 30 10 plus 3 x plus 3 Remember, if you have to add, you have to write the letter in right side. If you have to subtract, you have to write the letter in left side. Now, 14 again, 10 plus 4. Now, you can take the help of this table. That is 1, 2, 3, 4. So, 10 plus 4. 4 we know that is I and V. So, X, I and V. That is 14. 15, 10 plus 5. X and v 16 10 plus 6 10 plus 6 now 17 10 plus 7 10 plus 7 18 10 plus 8 10 plus 8 19 10 plus 9 10 plus 9 and 20 we can repeat x so we can write 10 plus 10 it will be 20 by this thing, uh, rule you can write the numbers from 21 to 30 how we will write 21 means 20 plus 1 so you will write 20 double x and 1 22 20 plus 2 double x plus double i in that way you can complete this series now how we will write 30 30 means we can repeat x so 1 2 and 3 10 plus 10 plus 10 this is 30 now 40 we cannot repeat x more than 3 times so how we will write 40 just see here l stand for 50 so if we will subtract 10 from 50 we will get 40 so how we will subtract 50 minus 10 so 50 minus 10 means we have to subtract x from L. So, X we will write in left side and L in the right side. Okay. Now, 50. 50 will be for L. Now, 60 means 50 plus 10. 50 plus 10, L for 50 and X for 10. 50 plus 10, 60. Now, 70, 50 plus 20. 70, 50 plus 18. 
that is sorry 50 plus 30 80 now 90 90 again we know that c stands for 100 so if we will subtract 10 from 100 we will get 90 100 minus 10 100 means c if we will write x to the left side of the 100 it means 100 minus 10 this is 90 and this is for c for 100 so i hope children you have understood how you will write the roman numerals just check again we use only these letters to write the roman numerals they are i v x l c d m and we have to follow certain rules what are the rules first some letters which we can repeat they are i x c and m but these letters we can repeat only three times not more than three times second rule we can subtract or add some smaller letters to the bigger letters but which letter we can add and subtract they are fixed now just see i we can subtract or add to v and x x we can subtract to or add to c uh, l and c and c can be subtracted or added to d and m so by taking this rule in mind by these systems we can write the roman numerals i have written here 1 to 10 11 to 20 and some 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 and 100 i have written here so you will get the uh, take the help of this chart and the assignment home assignment is you have to write the hindu arabic numerals 1 to 100 in roman numerals in your rough notebook and with your parents you can go to the extra marks apps and there is the roman numerals chapter is given there you can take the help of that with your parents you can practice this okay bye and take care thank you